guys. Now what are you doing? Now you're going to print it? Yeah. <laughs> 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 And I get a treat and knowing that that response is what's responsible, you know, that takes a lot of time. Oh. Up, now his mom's going to join him. And when she touches the screen, she gets a treat. One set of programs is designed to help us look at their cognitive abilities. And this is very exciting for us because um, orangs are fairly understudied when it comes to cognition. We know a lot about the cognition of their close relatives, the chimpanzee, but comparatively, orangutans have been very little studied. And so this will give us an opportunity to ask some of the same questions that have been asked of chimpanzees, but now to ask it of orangutans so we can better understand their cognitive abilities. Yield is in terms of where they touch for responses to predators. So right now it's pretty big to just get them to understand, oh, I touched it, a response. Mm -hmm. And then over time we can narrow it's it and narrow it so we can get a finer. very precise response out of them. But now it's really just getting them to, um, and they recently... Right now we're working on training them to understand the touch screen. So they need to actually understand that when they touch the computer screen that that's actually registering a response. So we have a very simple program that just has a picture of an orangutan and every time they touch the picture the orangutan disappears and they get a treat. And then the next program that we're using with them is something called matching to sample. And this is a very standard program that's used in cognitive tests. And the idea here is that they're shown a sample, so they're shown a photograph, and then they're shown four additional photographs. And one of them matches the original photo that they saw. And so they have to pick the one that matches. And once they learn that basic concept that when we show them a picture, they have to pick the one that matches, we can apply that to a whole host of questions. So that's something in there that's just for them to have fun. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, Junie! He said, I got an activity. Yeah, and uh, that his... Look at that. <laughs> that looks great. So now he's going to get a treat. You see him go yeah. down and get a treat because he, he touched it in the right spot and it made it go away. Oh. And so for this program you see behind me, this is a painting program, and what they do is every time their finger touches the screen, it actually puts a dot of color. And if they drag their finger across the screen, it will drag that dot of color. And they can go to the screen over here on the right and actually pick which color they want. So if they touch red, then when they touch the screen, the red paint will come up. And if we see them paint later, you'll see that they actually like to use a lot of colors. They'll switch the colors around. So. Any Picassos out there? Um, we do have one, and you know, sometimes we give them names based on what we see. And it's, you know, they do some excellent ones. Adam, or even just like something high on the perch looking down and you can see the whole... The biggest thing is pork making and then adding another ring. You know, they get first dibs and you saw Alan doing all his playing. Well, that's a lot of what they'll do around this probably. He's inside. He'll come out like when you guys are done. He'll come out. So, Madhu gets, Madhu gets to work uninterrupted. Oh, yes, you you. You're painting a pretty painting, Madhu? Uh-oh, what happened to your... Normally, there's another male and another female in this group, but because we're just, you know, tr trying to get them used to... I mean, I don't know if you saw her, but she's very deliberately pointing. Are you going to paint, Madhu? So, I don't know if you guys can see, this is... A, they're making this painting over here by... It's a touch screen. Mm -hmm. So, by touching the screen with them... Oh, God. To me, the biggest link that this project has to conservation is that hopefully it will get people excited about orangs. It will show how incredible these animals are, how unique they are, how like us their intelligence is. 
Um, and so this will enable hopefully people to care more about these animals and want to understand what's happening to them in the wild and maybe become active in saving orangutans in the wild. get a treat and knowing that that response is what's responsible, you know, that takes a lot of time. It's not bad. I have <laughs> had my longer lens.